Hey guys, it's your own girl Anna here, and in today's video we're going to be going through a Spider-Man inversion sequence. Here we go. So you're going to start by holding the whole hammock up against your sacrum below your hip bones in back belts. Then taking two little baby steps back up on your tiptoes to tension. You're going to tuck your chin in your chest and slowly come back your torso to lock the hammock in. And then you're going to carefully tiptoe forward till your hips are back into the palm line before sliding your hands up in a basic grip and simply tipping back and wide straddling the legs all the way around into Spider-Man. Relax the arms down the floor. You can hold here. For a minute or so to just let your spine decompress and stretch back out, just letting your body relax into this. But for the sake of time, we're gonna, we're gonna go through this whole sequence right now. So next, you're gonna take both palms and carefully walk them forward. So you can't go any further, lifting your chest up at the same time before letting your shoulders sink back, head relax between your arms. For a decompression stretch. So stretching out the front of the body here, especially your abs. Just take a few deep breaths. Let those muscles lengthen. And then we're going to twist out the spine a bit here using just our hips. The key for this is to keep your head still here the entire time as the rest of your body moves. First, we we'll start by opening the hips to one side. And then the other, do that a few times, back and forth, really trying to get your hips and legs parallel to whichever walls are on the side of you. And then you're gonna inhale, come back to center. Slide your hands underneath you, pressing the palms into the floor. You're gonna hook both feet on the hammock in monkey, bring your elbows in nice and tight. And to come up into handstand next, the key for this is to always straighten your legs up the hammock first and lock it in before putting pressure through your palms and straightening your arms. So here we go. I'm gonna inhale as I straighten my legs up, then I press up through the arms, zip the legs together, drawing in slightly through the core as I gaze forward, holding in handstand. Hold there for a few breaths. When you're ready, release your arms first. Let your hands relax back out to the side and then slowly slide both feet and heels back down, letting the knees bend out into Spider-Man. Next, coming into Chandelier, the great hip opener. You're gonna keep your left foot hooked on the hammock as you release your right leg straight out to the side, keeping it as low and level to the floor as possible, keeping the hands relaxed. You're gonna slowly, or first, I'm gonna interlace my fingers behind my back, drawing the shoulder blades together, and then I'm gonna sweep the leg behind, holding it straight, toes pointed for two breaths. To really open up those front hip flexors and the heart. And then I'm gonna bend my knee and simply slide my foot into my interlaced hands for chandelier, or you can Unhook the hands and regrip one hand at a time. It doesn't really matter. You're gonna hold here for a few breaths in chandelier. And then if you wanna get really fancy, you can try inverted mermaid by hooking your right elbow around your toes, bringing the opposite arm up over your head and interlacing the fingers together again. An inverted mermaid, holding here for just a few deep breaths. When you're ready, release the foot, bring the leg out to the side. We're gonna do one more cool pose here before switching sides, it's called side star. So keeping this leg out, I'm gonna hook my left toes over to this side of the hammock, reaching up, I'm gonna grab the hammock above my left foot on this side, and in one smooth motion, I'm gonna pull and push this leg out to the side, dropping the opposite leg down and holding in side star always looks pretty cool. 
and then to slide back down, you're gonna bend the left knee, release, and then let yourself kind of naturally unwind back to center. Before sweeping the right leg around to switch sides. And now during that same sequence on this side, hook the foot, bring the leg out, interlace the fingers, find your back, bring the leg behind, hold straight for two breaths. So bend the knee, come into chandelier, hold, and then come into mermaid, And then bring the leg back out to the side. Hook the right toes over. Reach up from the hammock above the foot. And one more time. Pull, push. Let that left leg drop down. For side star. Then again. And your knees sliding back down. And coming back into Spider Man. All right, to finish this sequence, we're gonna come up into Vitruvian Man and then a roll down. So, hooking both feet flexibly in quick, wrap the hammock between your knees, and then above your feet, one hand at a time, for gripping the shins and feet forward through the hammock, and then walking the hands all the way up. You're gonna pull all the way out into Vitruvian Man. Hold here for a few breaths, keep the weight tilted forward over your hips. All right, and then when you're ready, to come, or if you want to get a little more fancy, we can add it to your belt here as well. Bringing both hands forward into reverse grip, elbows forward towards the mirror. And then you can either bring your legs straight behind you, really arching that spine, opening up through the front body, or you can Bend the knees, bring the toes in together, nice and pretty. Either way is fine. And then doing one final roll down to come back to the floor. Again, you're going to bring the hammock underneath your armpits. Do a flip through and all the way down into Spider-Man. And that 